Hey guys, so today I'm going to be reviewing a product that I've been seeing all over Instagram lately. It is the Il Maquillage Foundation in the concealer. So it came in this packaging. I'm not going to flip it around because it has my address on it, but it actually, I actually got it in the mail two days before um, it said that it was supposed to be delivered, so that was really nice. So here, let's see. Set this up right here. So this is the box that it came in. Let's open it. I've already opened it, but I haven't tried it on yet. Let's see if I can remember how to open this. I wanted to try this out. Um, so it says so yours to try for 14 days, starting on the day they were delivered. Love it or return it. If you love them, keep them. If you shockingly don't, visit ilmaquillage.com slash return to download your return label and send back any returns within 14 days of delivery. At the end of the trial, you'll only be charged for the products you keep. So I got two different products. Okay, I got so the two things that I picked out was the Woke Up Like This Flawless Base Foundation. Um, and then I also got the F on Flawless Multi-Use Perfecting Concealer. Let's see. So I think, so I took a quiz online to find out what my, what shade I was gonna be getting. And I got the shade, whoop, let's see, where's the shade? 155. So they picked out this color for me. Um, hopefully it is a good match. I feel like I can never find a good foundation that matches my skin perfectly. Um, I don't know if any other like biracial girls have the same problem, but I literally can never find a foundation that matches my skin. It's either too white looking or like uh, too orangey. Concealer is in the shade 10. All right, so I've seen a lot of people there, they apply it with brushes, so I'm just gonna, usually I use a sponge, Whoa, what happened here? Okay, it's like all in the inside of the pump. Well, I don't wanna waste any of this, so I'm gonna wipe it off. Ugh, that's messy. Okay. I don't know if you guys can see this. Um. Let's see if I can get some better lighting. It has a weird smell to me. I don't know if you guys can tell, but when I look in the mirror, it looks a little orangey. That was a lot. So just for the two things that I got, it was seventy dollars. Um, it's yeah, it's kind of up there for me, anyways. But I like that I can try this out for fourteen days, and if I don't like it, I can return it. I just maybe if I let it sit for a while, it'll stop looking like so orangey to me. Let's see. It's not that bad. Especially for them picking it themselves and I did not pick the color. Let's try the concealer.
I actually don't mind the concealer at all. Let's do the other eye. I just poke myself in the eye. Then I'm going to take my Hoola bronzer, let's see, I just used this brush, so yeah, so this is just basically something I would do, just like an everyday look, everyday makeup look. I really don't know what I'm doing when I do my makeup. I just, I mean, I try to make it look good, but I, I'm not the best with makeup. I already know that. <laughs> okay, I'm going to put this back in its case. All right, so this is the blush that I use. It actually, the clear part that goes in here fell out a while ago. Um, but it's, I got it from MAC. I have no idea what color it is. I think it says Film Noir. I'm not sure. I can't really see, but. So. Alright, so now that we got that, I'm gonna go get my later bring this over here okay so don't judge my nails my, don't judge my nail polish I know it's hideous it's chipped I need to take it off I just I haven't done it <laughs> This is the mascara that I've been using. I don't like it, I don't like the applicator, but it's the one that I bought, so I'm just gonna use it until it runs out. This is how it looks. This, yeah, the last thing that I would do is lips. And brows, whoa, I can't believe I was gonna forget that. So I used the Anastasia Beverly Hills 
dip brow. I need to go in here and get this. I am not a pro at all at doing my eyebrows, but I try. What is that pink stuff? Okay. Stuff is dried out. Oh. Holy crap, you see that? Lord. Yeah, I gotta use this mirror. Sorry. Woo! I get so shaky when I do my brows. This is the one brow. All right, there you go. Go color. Okay, so I'm done with my brows. Never mind the mess in the background. I'm. I still have to clean my room. I was in the middle of cleaning it, and then I forgot that I wanted to film this video. Um, so I did my other brow off camera, just so it was just easier for me to do. But now, the only thing I have to do is put some lipstick on. I found it, so it was in my bathroom. So I'm gonna be using this. It is Lip Service High Shine Lip Glaze. Um, so let me put, I'm just gonna go in with this. This is a Wet n Wild Lip Pencil by 7-Eleven. So I probably need to sharpen it, but. Yeah, it definitely needs to be sharpened. And then this is Morphe's, what color? It's a matte fling, matte fling. I guess that's the color of it. All right, now I'm gonna put some of this on top. I am not definitely, definitely not a lip gloss girl. I used to be in high school and middle school, but for some reason I don't like it so much now. To set this. I don't really know why I'm setting my face because I'm not going anywhere or doing anything, but it's been going to the gym. So this is the final result. Um, I'm pretty pretty happy with it. Like the color's not perfect, obviously, but like I said, I have a hard time finding um, the perfect match for my skin tone. But for me, just taking a quiz online and them coming up with this as my color, I say they did a pretty good job. Um, yeah, I think it's worth paying the five dollars. Basically, you're, you're just paying for the shipping of the products, and then it comes in the mail. And like I said, these two products were seventy dollars total. So if I'm not, I'm gonna try them out for another week. And if I'm not completely happy with the color of the foundation, I'm just gonna send it back and then I don't have to pay the $70. But like if I wanna keep the concealer, which I think I might, cause I really like it, um, I would just pay for the price of the concealer and then whoop, send the foundation back. Um, but anyways, yeah, so I've just been seeing this brand all over Instagram lately. So I wanted to test it out and so yeah. much for watching and if you have my kids are doing something in there I should probably go check on them but anyways like I was saying thank you guys so much for watching and if you haven't subscribed to my channel please do so um, and I'll see you in my next video okay, Bye. So I wanted to see how the makeup looked in different lighting and it doesn't look as orangey to me in this lighting and this lighting is like more bright lighting in my kitchen so it's not that bad like I actually like it